Hey, welcome to episode 6 of the Lugs Play, uh, Ultimate Doom. Uh, today we're doing E1M6, the central processing plant. Um, some really, 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 really tough bits in this one. It's the actual, probably one of the toughest levels in uh, the first game. Um, just due to, like, mob placement, again, it's, it's it'd be an absolute bastard to... I say that, we, we want it, we, we want we like it because it's dirty, it's that pot noodle isn't it? Oh for god's sake, that was terrible, just died. Uh, so again, uh, it shouldn't be too, too bad, and again I'm still ill I'm afraid, I'm still feeling sorry for myself a little bit. Uh, so, I just come out, turn right, and uh, we'll enter this massive room, this, this room is actually pretty cool. Try desperately not to disturb the barrels as you kill the mobs that are already standing. Purely because you'll definitely need the barrels later on. Now I actually did this level quite recently. I did, well, I did the whole uh, episode quite recently uh, on my Xbox. And this level did actually prove a little bit of a hassle. So what we're doing is I'm just running forward and sprinting backwards. So as you sprint forward to get the key, sprint backwards, every single mob in the whole world gets opened up and basically you've got a huge fight on your hands. There's something behind me. Okay, that's fine. Oh brilliant, he shot me. And again, at this point we're trying to get those barrels just to see if we can do some extra damage. Which works quite well actually. Terrible. Oh for god, that was awful. That was the most fail ever. So again, because we were so friggin' high tailing it, uh, it was difficult for the mobs to keep up with us, so some of them might still just be knocking around. So I've just been a little bit careful with where I'm placed today. Okie dokie. So. Here we go. Right, good. Whew. Right, so all the only reason you go into that room is to get the red key. So here we go, red key's already got. Now, you might see this little thing over here. This isn't a secret as such, but as you walk in, watch to your right, blow those barrels and then jump out. Hey, hey, lots and lots of health kits. And again, those health kits are probably even going to be useful to us, even though we're on 151 health currently, okay? They're going to be very useful to us. Two dead in one shot. Oh, missed the other one, never mind. Come on. He's dead and he's dead, and he's not dead. Oh. Okie dokie. Just watch, basically everywhere you go in this level, something's gonna pop out on you. Definitely, definitely. Now here we've got two, I think, of the four secrets on the level. Is it four secrets? Yeah, four secrets on the level. There's two in this room, okay? So normally you go, you go and get your blue key and you'd bugger off, but any sane person would go, hang on a minute, what's this thing here? So let's find out. Uh, let's get everything we need. Hup. So I'm sprinting now, guys, right? So as we sprint, this lift comes down, and we're given a supercharge. Now let's run, sprint, 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 sprint. Can't get back up there, so go this way. And again, we get a blue armor, mega armor here. The blue flower armor. Um, and then, ooh. So, we get a soul, uh, invisibility uh, armor, that's good. And we get our amplification visor. Amplification visor, cranky. I think I forgot that in the last episode because I'm useless. So, now we've got the blue key. We've used our red key from the red key door. Now we've just got this room. Okay, now we go into this room right at the start, but um, it's just a little bit hairy. And also we don't have the right keys to get out of it, so we might as well leave it. So we can see lots of demons around in this room, so I'm going to switch to the chain gun. Now I know the speed. Oh god, run, 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 run. Just give yourself that little bit of distance, guys. Just, just back. Don't be afraid to backtrack through the levels. Sometimes it's just necessary. Plus, I've got a bloody invisibility on, on me, which buggers the imps up no end. Yeah, okay, you're dead. Let's see, told you. <sighs> through the middle, you can see the shotgun guy gets released, which is a bit of a pain in the ass. Okay, okay. Right, yes, that's actually running out, which is a good thing. So again, as we walk in, green power armor there, just in case you've uh, lost that back to point. Now, from this room, you've got three exits. Yellow key door, yellow key door, and through here, yellow key door. Before you go any further, there should be a couple more demons to kill. Spectre got stuck up there, which is good, so he's dead. 
Uh, now, all yellow key doors, so we've got to think, shit, where the hell do we get out of here? There must be a blue key door around here somewhere. And as you come in, if you turn right, you get off onto this, this area over here. Just full of bloody imps everywhere, okay? Now, again, there's some cool little secrets in here as well. Oh, bloody hell, left the shotgun guy. Cardinal sin. Uh, and I'm not going to start repeating exactly what I say in every episode, so I'm, I'm trying my best not to say, Oh, guys, go for the shotgun! Don't do anything differently. Now, I've come down here to the blue key door and I've not pressed go because... What's it done again? It's made mobs appear behind me again. So you just be super careful. I think also... It may... Oh, there's another one. Now, there's a mistake you could make here because there's lots of secrets, okay? This, this area now has got all the secrets in it. So, we want to get up there because in there, we might be able to see... There we go. You can just see it peeking out. The yellow key up there. Yeah? So, loads of ways through. Uh, this way leads to a maze. Or, this way. If we skid across here. Again, you can get your uh, radiation suit and everything like that. But I'll save that for later. Because we can hit this. As we hit this, we get uh, one of those annoying spheres of doom. And the rocket launcher. And then, a blue key door. Another blue key secret. Blue key secret. Sneaky, sneaky. We can get a yellow key. And then we could just sneak back out again, yeah? But we don't want to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to show you the legit way of doing it as well. So, oh, here we go. Nice and simple. We've got a maze, okay? Every room we come into has got a couple of exits. I tend to hang, hang a right straight away. Just because if we hang a right straight away, we actually get led into a room that we're going to need later on. So, here you can see is the entrance to that room where we just got the yellow key. Alright. We're going to take it nice and slow. We're going to head straight forward. Which can actually make us turn back on ourselves, which is quite strange, actually. Okie dokie. And again, let's just keep going. And again, just be careful, because it's going to come out from, from everywhere. Take a right, and then we've got a lever. Now again, we always like levers because levers going to open stuff up for us. Okay, so let's oh, press press the lever, and that's going to open that locked door from before. So if we headed back the way we came, we'd have an open door, but we don't want to go there yet. So let's go back to where we were. Take a right. So back to the lever. Then uh, no, we don't want to go this way. We go this way. So where the lever is, take a right. This is real cute. Look. Uh, uh, uh. So it's like an arrow pointing to this weird little bit here. Now this isn't a secret, okay? Because it's so obvious, I think. It's just not a secret. Which leads us to a little uh, area map. So now we can see all the area map and everything that's been on there, which is pretty cool. So here we go. Uh, let's go through here. Okie dokie. And now, because we've got two area maps, I think, it's actually showing us where the mobs are as well, which is awesome. Okie dokie. So now, back through to the start. Nice and slow. And again, we're going to walk up. Hear some scariness, because there's some things open behind us. I'm going to switch to my rocket launch here, because I'm going to turn and shoot. Oh, that, eye. that was fun. That's the first time I've resorted to it, actually. Just sometimes, you know, you need to do massive damage in a certain a sustained area. So there's that size of As good a chance as any you're going to get. Plus, I've got 66 rockets. I don't need all these rockets for everything. So, now we need to go back out there. We could go the normal way, which turn left, but I think I'll just use the secret. Oh, for fuck's sake. Because we also want the radiation suit for this bit. So, let's switch to our radiation suit. And let's just screw these guys over. Now, again, these guys, again, have appeared behind us. And they appeared down a little alcove. It's, you know, it's quite difficult to see, I guess. We could just go out here and go to our three yellow key doors, but let's work out what's down the alcove. So let's go. Do, 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 do. Uh, here we go. So, another area. A secret is revealed! Right. So, again, nice and simple. We got our secret. And we got a shitload of guys that are annoyed at us. This is the bit where we're going to lose a little bit of health because they're shotgun guys and there's a lot of them. Christ. 
And again, there are imps in this room that you're going to be largely ineffective against, for the most part. So again, just get what you can get. And then we can see a supercharge, which is cool. Gives us up to 100% health. Now this bit is quite scary. Again, go up there and just, again, always keep watching for this one. Because if you get fireballs thrown at you, you'll only hear them right at the last minute. Here we go. Back up we go. Oh, for God's sake. That's, that's unlucky, isn't it? Oh, that, 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 was, that was incredibly lucky, I suppose. One of them shot the other one. Love it. Okay. Oh, look, another spectre. Brilliant. Okie dokie. So we're starting to get slowly closer toward the hairy bit, and uh, I'm starting to get a little bit scared for everything now. So now what we are is we're actually behind the yellow key doors. I'm going to show you where those yellow key doors would lead to. I can leave those guys there because they actually can't get down here for some unknown reason. So if we were to go back to the yellow key room, you know, we have three options. We could go through here to get yellow key, here to get yellow key, here to get yellow key. If we go through the main one, well, I'll say main one, the forward one. Um, we can go through the yellow key door, everything's sweet, everything's happy, everything's lovely. Yellow key, yellow key, yellow key. That's how you get it anyway, all right? So down here to our left is a, well, it should be a locked door, but then because we pressed that switch at the top there, um, it's now unlocked and ready to go. Let's skip across, kill him, kill him, kill him. Oh, wow, well, this is gonna get hairy. Just keep moving away from these demons. Now, if we were to go down here now, there's some mobs. How did I die? That was amazing. Okay. Oh, Christ. Your health is very, very precious in this room. This room is an absolute dickhead, right? Really be careful in this room. This room is a nightmare. Make sure you go in both ways. Clear out as much as you can clear out, and I'm just being careful because I don't know if these doors shut just yet. Then we'll go up top. Okay, and we can look down at this room as well. So, lots of different ways in. And here we go. It's one of those bloody moments now, folks. Okay, I could horribly die at this point. Uh, I'm just going to chance it. You should die. You should die. Right. Be careful. Just again, collect everything in the room and. It sounds really odd because the barrels could help you later on, but you could be stood too near one when an imp hits you, okay? This room kicks off and there is no escape. As soon as you press this button, those doors close, okay? This door over here opens, which actually leads us to our final sort of point. But uh, yeah, nothing more than that. So, here we go. Run. So again, here is quite an exciting bit. Oh god. Come on. And again, it doesn't really allow you to move around very much, okay? So again, now, just goad them, guys. Just goad them as best you can. Because again, all you're going to do now is just sprint, okay? And I couldn't move around then because I was pinned in. There was just so many of them. <sighs> okay, right. That, isn't, that, is, that is very difficult. So here we go. Uh, now they're all dead. Obviously, the thing's open again, which is really helpful. Gets you back to your 100% health, which is good. But I'm at 42% armor, so I'm going to switch back here because we've got a green power-up. So now I'm on 100-100, which is pretty good. Pretty good. And again, my heart was actually pretty much racing there because I've died so many times in that room and I really didn't want to die in front of you guys so you could all take the piss. Uh, so, nice and simple. And I didn't press the switch, which is why this isn't open. So I press the switch now. It opens even more mobs, so do be careful. If you did open that switch, you pretty much will definitely die. Okay. Ooh, bloody hell, he says. Try not to die. And again, you can't see the bloody things as well. Don't get yourself cornered, guys. Can you see any more? I think we're okay. Whew. Again, scary, guys. Super scary. Um, get that. So I've got 100% shells. What was that? Alright. Scaring myself now. Here we go. Oh. Oh. There's one stuck in the wall. Can you see it? I think we're okay, guys. Right, and that is uh, Central Processing. Central Processing is an absolute dick. So we've got all four secrets. Um, and we are now at the end of the level. So, let's see how we did. 
Oh, 87 percent seems to be the same amount as I get every single time. So that's central processing done. That's the end of this episode. So thank you, thank you very, very much for watching. And the next one, we've got the computer station. Okay, so it's one level before the last level now, folks. We're getting there. Okay, thank you very much for watching. I love you. Bye!